So at Training for Safety, uh, we have a lot to do with fire training and obviously talk quite a bit about that and have done over the years in a, in a number of our posts uh, out to you all. So ultimately during the, the summer period, we, can, we get outdoors a lot more. We're using barbecues and braziers and open fires. So <clears throat> just take that time, keep an eye on fire and emergencies um, if there is fire bans and local council restrictions as well. So follow their guidelines. And if you are going to light a fire in a particular area, whether it's on your own property or anywhere, make sure that you're not putting yourself or others at risk. You're looking at what's the wind direction. You know, have we got a nice safe area around? Have we got a hose nearby or an extinguisher as well? We've gone through just recently in November, obviously, um, fireworks, Guy Fawkes. So some people have kept all those and they use them during those summer months, Christmas, New Year's Eve. So uh, follow all the same guidelines that everybody's told you about those safe location, control who's lighting those fireworks as well. And don't set them off in a silly place because it's only going to end up with a bad result. So be fire safe over that summer period and check out Fire and Emergency New Zealand's website. They've got some great information there as well. And most of all, be safe and be fire smart.